Break the bias. Break the bias. Break the bias. Break the bias. My most inspiring woman is Melanie Perkins, who is the CEO and co-founder of Canva. They are building software to make graphic design accessible for everyone without needing expensive and complex software. Melanie is one of the few female CEOs um, to have set up a tech unicorn, uh, so a company that's valued over a billion dollars, and it's one of the few tech unicorns that's actually profitable. My most inspiring woman is Ada Lovely. She was the first woman to develop mathematical theories which enabled us to now apply them to modern day web applications. She inspired me to study mathematics myself and then go on to learn how to code at the wagon where I have the opportunity to now teach other amazing women how to code. Um, so the most inspirational woman in my life today is uh, an old colleague of mine, her name is Sharla Duncan and she currently runs a company that promotes uh, people from diverse ethnic backgrounds into uh, jobs in tech uh, and I know her because she also helps set up a charity. She founded a charity um, helping educate uh, people from disadvantaged backgrounds. Uh, my most inspiring woman is a bit cliche but um, it's my mother. Uh, she managed to raise five kids including me uh, which must have been difficult but um, she taught us how to be God-fearing kind and most importantly confident. Um, when she was younger she ran a successful business, it was a beauty shop and um, salon called Pretty Woman um, but later on in life she had a calling for philanthropy so she started this non-governmental organization called the Free Foundation. Free standing for family, reorientation, education and empowerment. So she built a library, um, she taught many women how to read, um, also taught them different skills like fish farming, tailoring and um, other things. Um, sadly, she passed away in January 2009, but I believe she lives on in all of us, family, friends, and most of the people that she touched.